It's almost summertime and it feels so good and so warm. June has arrived and brought with it some big stuff and also some really wrong stuff. Today we're talking about wedding season events gone wrong. I thought this was just a simple event. Hang out with Harvey. I guess I should have known Harvey's involved. It wasn't going to be simple. But you know, make a little cute wedding scene. Get some crystal hearts. Get some items and away you go. But I was so wrong. And I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about today. Plus, there's a contest for you guys to win some eShop monies. Follow us on Twitter and check the tweet there. I want to see you guys' best, craziest, most impressive wedding scene photo that you've created. The best one will win a $10 eShop card. Click the link in the description to find us on Twitter, twitter.com slash the switchforce, and enter your photo. But I gotta tell you, before we get to the craziness, the wildness that you have to see, one of our old friends has returned. Judy was a Lisa Frank lethal villager that we had to say, Gotcha. But that caused a gazoon tight, which was that Lyman got sneezed straight out of Peach Reef. And he's back, baby. On a recent stream, we got Lyman to return. I begged him. I pleaded. I said, hey, please come back. And he's like, okay, I know. I appreciate you. I love Peach Reef. It was really, really wicked of you to kick me off for Judy. But I understand. She's coveted. And I'm just koala, but I love that my koala buddy is back. And I love you guys so much. Thanks for all your support. I appreciate it lately. It's just been cruising. It's been so much fun. If you guys have been enjoying the videos, smash that like button. Let me know in the comments down below your favorite part of June thus far. I'll tell you my least favorite. That the freaking Dodo liquidation service can only be used on Harvey's Island. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's so dumb. Why only on Harvey's? It's such a great idea. A nice quality light feature. And it's no longer a quality of life feature. It's just a weird of life feature because who goes to Harvey's all that often? Now, I will tell you that shark season is pretty awesome. I got four sharks in my pretty little pockets and it feels great. I'm working on that great white shark trophy so that once CJ arrives, I can have him make a statue of the big mouth. Boy, I love catching those sharks. Even if you get suckered by the sucker fish. What am I talking about these wild weddings gone wrong? Let's take a peek at this. So Polygon posted this article. This is where it kind of originated. And they showed that people have been making weddings gone wrong. They're not just trying to put the cute wedding benches in and make Cyrus and Reese happy. They're like, you know what? Let's get wild with it. I was supposed to get married last month, so wedding season might have been a little triggering. I'm fine. This is fine. I'm going to show you a few of the Polygon ones, but I found some that are even better across the interwebs. And we're going to check them out and react to them together. They've got this creepy one here. It's like, dungeon? I think that dungeon mask might be a little too much for Animal Crossing, but okay, they put it in there. Reese and Cyrus are getting married, and I guess that wedding went Romeo and Juliet really fast. How about Scorpion Palooza all over the island? Do not kiss the bride. If you move, you will get bit. This one's the most horrifying of all. Zipper returns for the wedding? Oh my gosh. If I ever got married in a zipper-themed wedding, couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Love my life. Sorry. Sorry. Honestly, if the love of my life loves Zipper, they're not the love of my life, okay? Uh, get married or get perished. I like this. It's like the evil wheel that says you have a sliver of chance at living and a big whole slot of death. Reese and Cyrus did say they had some sort of schmoozy special love. I guess it's a little bit odd. We've got some really funny pictures here. I like them a lot. They're quite interesting. Getting divorced right after the wedding. Um, creepy graveyard wedding with skeletons. How about fire disaster wedding with trash? Doesn't seem like a spirited wedding, but let me show you some really, really, really interesting weddings gone wrong. Wedding? Nah, it's a funeral. Goodness gracious. Cyrus went down. Kiss of death from AC Adventures 1. I love this photo. I don't know how you got them to pose so beautifully like this. This is true majesty. I like this so freaking much. Neo Namaro with the KO of King Cyrus. What is it with Cyrus? Why is he always going down? They got married and Reese is like cackling that Cyrus got punched straight to the mat. How did this happen? Who even did it? Was it Reese? Was it the officiant in the center? Who made this happen? Mysterious forces from beyond? I don't quite know. A gold clover says this is a weird wedding. Look at the freak out as Reese and Cyrus make out in the background. They are going full on snuggle bus face absorption. Sucker fish, give me everything you've got. Kiss the bride style. And they, they look evil, honestly. I don't know what's going on with Cyrus. I guess after he's been KO'd, 
and killed and put in a graveyard. Yo, that look. I, get this one off my page. Goodness, holy. Who needs Cyrus and Reese? The real wedding is between Godzilla and Mrs. God, what is the female Godzilla? Godzilla? Godzilla Jr. Either way, two dinosaur creatures, radioactive beasts getting married. I mean, it's a little spooky. I think they're going to crush the chairs. I wonder what they're eating. It does not look like enough food, but I really like this beautiful wedding from Puke Unicorn. Also a very unique name. Now we're getting somewhere with Dinos and Flames. Dear Reese, if you do not accept, walk the path of doom. I don't think you'll make it. Look at this. He's like, Reese, how dare you? Why did you KO me? Why did you kill me? Why is this wedding all about you? And then before you know it, Cyrus is again just screwed over. Somehow Reese wins. Reese is happy and Cyrus is like, I tried. I tried being nice. I tried being your victim. I tried being harsh with you. He, he can't catch a break. He just can't catch a break. But this is a pretty cool scene uh, from Alyssa. Once the gnomes enter the scene, you know things have got really weird. This is from Animal Nick. Everyone at the wedding is a gnome. Reese and Cyrus were like, we didn't make that guest list. We didn't pick these attendees. But I love the mushrooms and the gnomes and they're all just like, they look happy. They're ready to go. They're like, I'm so proud of this marriage. Oh, the creativity on display and the weirdness from the imagination station. It's just on point today to the supreme level. Another wedding full of nomenculture from Pole Dew. Aren't weddings beautiful? Yeah, man. When you've got all sorts of biker gnomes in attendance, leaf piles lining the aisle, traffic cones, oil barrels, and gas pumps. It's not the wedding for me, but this looks like a trucker's paradise. So I tried to recreate the wedding scene from Crazy Rich Asians. Don't know if you guys have seen that movie, but even if you haven't, this is a very dope wedding scenario here. Look at the detail. I got the piano player on the side, the harp and the guitar. Cyrus is like, come to daddy, Reese, please. Also, don't kill me, KO me, or do any of the things you've done before. This is from Eunice Crossing. If you take a look at the actual scene from the movie, pretty spot on. Maybe the dress isn't as fancy, but other than that, I'm seeing double. It's not all jokes though. This comes from Lostopia and it's actually really sweet. As someone who had to postpone their wedding due to COVID, I have to admit I'm really enjoying the wedding event. I went with the colors I will be going for at my own reception and it's made me excited again. Look at that. It's so swell. A beautiful wedding scene here. I really, really like what they've crafted and created. The tables look great. The colors look awesome. And this is, I think, what Nintendo intended for you to do. So, Lostopia, you, you did good. Five stars. Everyone else kind of went off the deep end, and I understand it. It's a lot of fun, but I also respect the quality weddings as well. If my wedding don't look like this, I don't want it. Monte Cad Coco is going to be tough to please. But this is a very beautiful wedding with a lot of neon pink and a lot of ethereal lights. I love the moons and the moons, and the stars, and the moons, and the flowers, and the photos, the art on the back, it looks so nice. I mean, check this out, Cyrus and Reese. You know it's gonna last when you got this sort of thing going on. They got candles laying across the aisle, flower carts, the beautiful windows in the scene. Oh, it's just majestic, and they don't even have someone leading the ceremony. It's just a record player. It's like all crackly and romantic. Oh, gosh. Man, I, I don't blame you, Mante Cod Coco. Uh, this is what I want, too. Pretty freaking beautiful. We got one more, and it also is just quite dandy. Look at Cyrus. He's like, I'm so proud I created this. Reese is like, oh, gosh, schmoopy poo. And then everyone's hanging out at the reception. All the tables and the tablecloth and the placemats. And then this is where Cyrus finds out that she's about to walk him into the other room where there's an aisle of death and fire and flames and it's actually going to be a jailed wedding, which is terrifying and creepy and borderline wrong. But they've got a TV, so hey, at least he can catch the NBA returning uh, in July. I love these ones where people put so much attention to detail and they're getting the characters to look so cute and happy and there's even little ducks. Everybody likes ducks. Also, everybody's using the flowers and everybody's using that record player. But they're all so pretty. I can't, I can't blame you guys. I can't blame you. So while I'm not the biggest fan of the wedding event myself, like, it's kind of fun to go and see what you can do and make the scenes. I love how much deeper this has devolved 
or evolved. And I honestly hope Nintendo makes more events of this sort where there's a lot of player input, where we get to see the creativity of the community. And that's why I'm challenging you guys over on Twitter for that contest. Submit your best wedding photo scene. It can be super crazy and wrong. It can be super beautiful. You got a nice mix of both, some really funny ones, some creepy ones, and some gorgeous ones. So give it your best shot, the best photo, we will give a eShop gift card, which will be a pretty fun time. Now, I am having a fun time because I've been downloading more and more clothes. And I've got two cool pieces of gear right now, as you can see. I've got the 1-Up Mushroom hat, and I've got the Samus hoodie that has Samus on the front and Mother Brain on the back. I love these a lot. So let's throw them on the screen. Congratulations to these creators. Fantastic work. They actually came from the stream. So, like I said, if you guys haven't seen the streams... You're missing out. They're so much fun. We have such a great time. You should absolutely come and be there. We're streaming like three to four times a week. You should absolutely check out the Discord server if you haven't yet already. It's really, really just, it's like the, the best, the best community. I love everybody so much. We're here for Harv. And let me give you a, a better look at these clothes uh, now that we're taking a quick peek at them. Look at that. That Samus hoodie is so nice. And that one up like NES color scheme mushroom hat. Really, really good. Now, Harv is the dude with the plan, and he's like, what do you want? If you didn't know about the wedding season, what you do, you go to Harv's Island every day, you set up an anniversary studio shoot, and then you get to these crystal hearts, and then there are uh, items that you can buy with them. And everyone's like, hi, how are you doing? What's up? Are you ready? Howdy, squirt. You want to trade those heart crystals for something I've got? And you can make a deal with him. Let's see what he's got today. It should be... I don't know if it's different or we have to buy through these. Oh, I have zero. No, I have three. No, I have zero. Who stole my hearts? Do they expire every day? Wait, do you really not save them? Or did I just not save my game? Because I definitely had nine for my last... My last photo shoot, I definitely had nine. The only thing I miss, like, I think these are so fun, right? I think setting the scene up is really beautiful. I just wish that I could... I wish I could stick my amiibo in there. Like, I've got Celeste, and I'd love to put Celeste into the wedding scene. I think that'd be so fun. I got kicks over there. Oh, it would just be so fun and Rover to put them in the scene. You're able to use the amiibo in Photopia for Harv's Island, but you know, it's just I really I really wish that they allowed other characters to participate in the wedding. And you know, it's creative to see the gnomes be in there and the dinos and the ducks and stuff. But wouldn't it be nifty and nice if you were able to put more in there um we've got all sorts of chairs and benches some different gear and some fun things that they have put out and they're going to add more i guess as you go we can throw these chairs down uh, or you can throw your own things in there but keep creating people and you know nintendo has released a bunch of different events we've seen them throughout the um throughout the month so far and some like international museum day are very disappointing and very boring and some like Bunny Day are a little overboard. And some that include and bring new characters like Red and our boy Leaf are, I think, right on the spot. This one seemed like it was going to be a dud. And yet with the creativity and the laughs that it's brought and with the fun items and with recent sires, I want more like this. Nintendo, this is a good event. You did good. I mean, I hope there's more to June and I really think there will be. I think Brewster is close. I feel like I hear him in my head every time I record. But... I like this one, and I want more of it. Let me know what you think of wedding season. What are some of your favorite wedding photos that you've seen? Are you guys excited for more content coming in June? If you haven't seen my June video to talk about everything that's happening in June, check it out. It just went up a couple of days ago. I'm excited. I'll keep you guys posted. Make sure to turn that notification bell on and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Big shout out to members. I'll see you guys on the streams and the next video. Until that time, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate all of you. Hope you're staying safe and staying healthy and staying positive. Until next time, everybody. Thanks again. Switch fours. Out.